so I have this Kohler generator outside the house here. It's a 12,000 watt um, RES. And I was getting the uh, surging and pulsing, and then I was also getting some backfire happening. So I uh, had replaced the spark plugs on both sides. There's one on each side. And I was still, it was it sounded like it was running good for a minute, and then it just went back to the um, backfire. So what I had done was pull the, uh, I pulled this air cleaner off from here. You know, I just had a, this little cover on this thing here. And I was shaking this plate around, trying to get this thing off. And then I noticed down inside of here that the bolt, one of the bolts on the carburetor was loose. And I could, I could literally shake this thing around. And uh, actually, I've got a video of it, so I'll just put, put that on right now. This is attached to the carburetor. And that carburetor is sucking air in. I can see this bolt isn't even screwed down right here. See that? It's just sucking air in here. Okay, you can see a better view of it now. See, see that? It's, this is literally how loose it was when I found this. Like either it wasn't tightened very well at the factory or this may have been worked on but i kind of doubt it i don't think this has been run very often I mean, it looks really clean in here but anyways yeah i think that's uh i think that's it uh, surges and pulses or or rolls or waffles or whatever you guys call it but uh if you're getting getting any of those symptoms uh, maybe check that out and if that is not the case um on these carburetors, you'd, I would check the, the needle, the jet, uh, check that jet out because that could be plugged up and that could be part of your issue right there. Looks like the air filter is pretty decent on the inside. I mean, the outside's a little. Actually, it looks pretty new. The outside could probably use a little bit of oil, but I think it's all right. Let's assemble that again. Fire it up. 